So it's Sunday, August 25th, 2024. And I thought I would start today's garden video here at the bonus tomato that was growing out of the compost pile. You can see the top of the plant is just chewed right off. I talked about this in my last video. And just a few feet away are the two bonus tomato plants that are growing in with the onions. The tomatoes still haven't turned red yet, but something ate the tops off of these plants too. And the bonus tomato plants over here in the newest section of the garden near the purple bell pepper plant. So last night I hit these areas with both powder and spray that's supposed to repel small and large critters. Cowhorn pepper plants are still producing and so are the Fresno pepper plants. I'm really, really happy with the results this year. So this orange bell pepper plant is finally ready. I mean, this pepper on the bottom, it's got a little bit of green on it, but I could pick it right now. There's another one that hasn't turned colors at all, but it's a good size right above it. The red bell pepper plant has this really big orange pepper on the bottom. It's been kind of yellowish orange for about two weeks now, and I might just have to pick it because I just don't know that it's gonna turn red. There's a smaller green pepper on the top, and I don't know if there'll be enough time left in the season for that to turn. There's a small green pepper and an even smaller one above it that's starting to uh, grow on the yellow bell pepper plant next to it. The Better Boy tomato plant in the corner still has a few green tomatoes on it, but I've been able to harvest some really good red tomatoes off of it as well. Some of them are so big they're splitting open. And the Lemon Boy tomato plant had a really slow start this year, but I've got a lot of tomatoes off of this and there's still some to to go before the season is up it looks like I might be harvesting a few more peppers off this cubanelle plant and the orange bite snacking peppers as well as the lunchbox red have made a, a lot of small sweet peppers that I've put in with the grape and cherry tomatoes to take as a snack in my lunch. I'll be harvesting a few things out of the garden today, but here's some footage from yesterday when I was picking a few things for dinner. All right, let's see. I need a jalapeno. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Look at that little guy up there. Twelve. I think this one right here, that's a good candidate. Let's see if I can get in there. go let's see we got a little green pepper up here the next one is a good size it's a little small this one down here at the bottom is the biggest yeah let's go ahead and pick this
I've got some tomatoes I can pick. Something keeps coming in here eating them, but there's so many that I guess it doesn't matter. It doesn't seem to like the uh, small tomatoes, whatever it is. I've got lots of these Lemon Boy tomatoes. Go ahead and pick a few of those. That one can get a little bit darker. That's the color I'm looking for. Lots and lots of these mild banana peppers. Let's see, I think I'll pick this one here. It's all curled up. Got two nice looking purple bell peppers. I think I'll pick this one. So one of the Thai hat pepper plants that's growing from last year's leftover peppers is producing. But what's unusual are these larger, longer Thai hot peppers. I didn't think they were supposed to get that big. And the other one is covered in tiny little red peppers. So there's the garden update for this weekend. I plan to do one next weekend for Labor Day weekend. Until then, thanks for watching.